Hello viewers, the density of soil can be determined by various methods. In this program, we shall demonstrate the determination of dry density of a soil using sand replacement method as per Indian Standard Code 2720 Part 28. The apparatus required for conduct of this practical includes sand pouring cylinder, cylindrical calibrating container, metal tray with hole, excavating tool, balance, glass plate, metal tray, sufficient clean uniform sand passing 1 mm and retained on 600 micron ISC and water content determination apparatus. To start with the practical, first of all, we shall determine the bulk density of the sand. For this purpose, we shall determine the volume of the calibrating container. Volume is equal to area into height, that is A into H, where area is equal to pi by 4 into D square. By putting the value of dia is equal to 10 centimeter and height is equal to 12.73 centimeter, the volume of the calibrating container is approximately equal to 1000 centimeter cube. Record the volume of the calibrating container. Now, fill the sand pouring cylinder with calibrating sand within about 10 mm of its top. Weigh the sand pouring cylinder with sand. Record the weight of cylinder with sand before pouring that is W1. Keep the sand pouring cylinder over the calibrating cylinder. Open the shutter and allow the sand to run out into the calibrating container till the calibrating cylinder is filled. Now close the shutter. Determine its weight. Place the sand pouring cylinder on a glass plate. Open the shutter and allow the sand to run out until no further movement of the sand takes place in the cylinder. Close the shutter and remove the sand pouring cylinder carefully. Collect the sand left on the glass plate in a container of known weight and determine its weight. Repeat the same operations two more times ensuring same weight of cylinder with sand before pouring. Record the mean weight of cylinder with sand after pouring that is W2.
record the mean weight of sand in cone of pouring cylinder that is W3. Weight of sand to fill the calibrating container that is WA is the difference of W1 minus W2 minus W3. Bulk density of sand is the ratio of weight per unit volume. So in this case it is 1.43 gram per centimeter cube. Now we shall determine the dry density of the soil. Expose an area of about 450 millimeter square on the soil surface where test is to be performed. Trim the surface to level it using a scraper tool. Keep the metal tray with the central hole on the prepared surface. Excavate a hole in the soil using excavating tool. While excavating, use hole in the tray as a pattern. Excavate up to a depth of 15 cm. Now collect the excavated soil. Weigh the soil and record the value in the performer. Record the weight of wet soil from hall that is WW. Fill the sand pouring cylinder with standard sand to the weight as recorded earlier. Record the weight of the cylinder with sand before pouring that is W1 This weight is same as recorded earlier. Place the sand pouring cylinder concentrically over the excavated hole. Open the shutter and allow the sand to run out into the hole until no further movement of sand takes place in the cylinder. Now close the shutter. Remove the cylinder from the excavated hole. Weigh this pouring cylinder with the remaining sand. 
record the weight of cylinder with sand after pouring in hole that is W4 weight of sand in hole that is WB is the difference of W1 minus W4 minus W2 that is the weight in cone of the calibrating cylinder volume of the hole is the ratio of weight per unit density of sand bulk density is the ratio of weight per unit volume so in this case it is 1.98 gram per centimeter cube take a small soil specimen of this soil for moisture content determination as per standard procedure water content of this soil is 13.62% dry density is the ratio of bulk density divided by 1 plus water content so for this soil it is 1.74 g per cm3 repeat the field operations in the same area at different places to obtain average results record all the observations in the performa the average dry density of the three values recorded is 1.75 g per cm3 so friends we can determine the in situation dry density of the soil using sand replacement method as per standard procedure